Linux Mint works perfectly fine with the X11 display server, but what if X11 went away? No problem, Windows 11 works perfectly fine. So I got some news off the ticker feed reader. GNOME is phasing out X11 support, starting with GNOME 50, which I believe is what, next year? And will be Wayland only. This means the X11 option will be removed from the desktop environment, making Wayland the sole display server option. Yeah, Wayland focus, GNOME is transitioning to a Wayland only environment with the X11 option completely removed. Impact on Ubuntu. This could change. <laughs> ah, this change could impact Ubuntu, which uses GNOME as its default desktop environment, potentially requiring users to migrate to Wayland or face unsupported configurations. Fedora's early removal. Fedora Linux has already been moved. The GNOME well, 11 session. That's okay. I don't recommend Fedora for Windows users anyway. This is from a GitLab. Git lab. Git lab. Let's get with it. GitLab announcement. The announcement is based on a merge request on GNOME's GitLab indicating the intention to remove the X11 session code. <sighs> Reasoning the removal is driven by the desire to simplify development, maintenance, and testing GNOME as Wayland is designed to be easier to extend and maintain. I'm all, I'm all for simplification, especially for Linux newbies. 100% for that. But Wayland is not ready. Again, you guys were complaining how once Windows 10 goes away and being forced to upgrade to Windows 11, and many, many PCs will not be able to run Windows 11. I've tried Wayland. It is not ready. Sure, if you go out and buy a new $1,000 or $2,000 Linux computer, will Wayland work? Yeah. But that's what you're going to tell Windows users? I'm sorry, this is just stupid. Uh, I, I have tested many, well, some, not many, some, screen recorders under Wayland. How many worked? Five, ten, six, one. OBS Studio is the only one that worked. Yes, Microsoft has done some dumb things, but they are not alone.